airplane. So I've been talking to, to my employees about this and COVID has changed so many things. So I know a lot of people always say, oh, people are working from home, people are working from home, people are working from home more, which is very true. For small business owners, it's more difficult to manage um, the small, the working from home kind of thing because of all the ins and outs. As a small business, business owner, it is difficult to manage a lot of things because you have to manage so much at one time. So the change that people are working from home, there's a lot more freelancers, I think, after COVID, which is nice because I can pick up freelance workers, um, whether it's social media managers, marketers, um, salespeople, um, international people that can ha handle service um, interactions for us that has changed and also after covid because of the inflation and then the less desirable work the high cost of daycare the high cost of um plus school schedules everything has changed so much i mean there's kids that still have virtual days so those you can't go to work on the days that your kid has virtual days because they cannot you know manage themselves on the virtual or then maybe they can't i don't know but there also has been a huge change in employees staying for long periods of time. I believe before COVID, if somebody stayed with you for two years, that that was a good amount of time. After COVID, if somebody stayed for you for two years, like that is insane that you got two years out of somebody, um, which that, that's a lot of turnover for training, which is difficult for small businesses. Um, but it just has changed so much when you talk about the pay. Um, like I see that rudders or as gas stations, um, most manufacturers are starting at or warehouse work is like $23 an hour maybe. Um, though I don't know how the flexibility is with that. That's also not always a desirable field for certain people depending on you know your situation. But these things has changed so much that I think it's going to cause a lasting change in our economy. We're going to see small businesses are going to start to pack up shop and get um, merged up that's happening a lot in my industry a lot of mergers with larger companies uh, private equity firms are buying up um, a bunch of different sectors so that way they have more market control that's going to be like the name of the game moving forward and tell me how you guys are trying to manage this because I mean I don't want to be the last man standing of course and I really want to make sure I'm making the right decisions on handling my payroll or my employees or my um you know the future like what is it going to look like for us or anybody or any small business pretty much